Today's Warzone video, I have two high kill gameplays here with the number one meta loadout for Rebirth Island. With this loadout, I dropped 70 plus kills over these two gameplays and I even broke my PR. I'm not going to spoil the amount of kills my PR actually is, but if you guys happen to enjoy today's video, give it a like, subscribe, notifications turned on, and of course the class at the end of the video. Ooh. What? You know what? Y'all can have that for the moment. Here, I just need to plate up and get my gun back. That guy, I literally played against like last game. This is a UGR. Hey, give me that. I like this thing. It's actually pretty fun. Would I put on a loadout? Don't know, but I kind of like it as ground loot. Ain't no way he actually landed right back up. Fella, I will wipe you. Well, technically he like wiped himself. But... Pistol Sands, I would have taken him out anyways. Gas is right on your tail. And I need some serious cash money. All right. Not bad, not bad. All right, we're gonna actually throw this down. We're gonna start agitating people. Um, actually, we'll keep the UG. Nope. Not today, Muffin Slammer. Wait, this guy didn't take himself out the game with that? Ain't no way. That was the guy that had the RPG earlier. So you're telling me he came back in. Dude, I don't know. I'm confused. Dude, what is going on? This room is a literal madhouse. I mean, I got dudes driving around with vehicles honking horns. I got random shenanigans all over the place. Like, dude, I don't know what's going on. I was gonna say, give me some plates, please. Lord knows I need those things. Okay. Just let me torch him first. Appreciate that patience and you waiting. Oh, it's still going off down here? Okay. They can they can do this now. I got I got my Marco, Marco XM4. Enemy UAV active. 
Just took out that guy right there, but I think there's still somebody up top, if I'm not mistaken. Yo. I say, let me get over here and check this stuff here. Come on, as I say, you can chase. I was flying on his screen, I know that for a fact. Is that someone? See, they're either going to be way up top or down below. Oh, yeah, you're free. What's this say? Can I go prone? Uh-oh, I see someone up top prison. Gas is closing in. This guy's going to know me very well by the end of the night. Oh, you know what? I'll go right over here. Oh, hell no. I think I will have enough money to get an extra UAV. I'll say, say it ain't so, you're trying to do that. I'll say, come on. Yep, thank you. I want to make quick work of him. We, we still got some crazy good potential this game. Oh, we definitely need to make quick work of this guy. Oh, yep. Ella, you can have that. Hey, don't take each other out up top there without me. Come on, hold up. Let me have some fun. Okay. There's somebody down there. What was that gunshot? Where are those gunshots going off? Ooh. That's a crazy little thing I got to edit out. I don't know if that was him that called me some, uh, some rather key terms, but shot his body. Enemy precision airstrike. Stay alert. Enemy precision airstrike. All right, I'm Stay staying alert. inside. My ass is grass normally. What's going on, big fella? Was not expecting that one. <laughs> hey, hi, how's it going? Alright, still enough people left in here. UAV, beginning flyover. Only five remain. Finish this once and for all. Thirty-nine. We actually we broke just PR right now. Out 
Oh my god, first ever 40 right there, you know what I'm saying? All right, let's see. He's got, oh, okay. So that's one guy. Gas is inbound. Marking new safe zone. Objective is to eliminate the bounty target. Gas is right on your tail. And my man's. Oh my god. Dude, what I just dropped? 42? Oh my lord. I broke my PR by like four kills. That is actually crazy. This is my first time playing this mode, by the way, so I was not expecting to find some uh, friendly camos like that. Um, RA-225? Well, actually, we'll take that. We're gonna go for this guy. Oh, I actually already picked up Scavenger. That was the perk I got. I don't know. If the, I don't care if this guy knows where I'm coming from. He's just straight ditching going like all the way up top. Me casually forgetting this is extreme. Serpentine ain't no way. People running serpentine in this mode? Oh, that is ridiculous. Oh, specialist bonus 75 hundo. Yeah, we may have to cop that real quick, you know what I'm saying? Okay, 5,900 right now. All right, fellas, here we go, here we go. rather tumultuous times in here yeah I was gonna say can I reload grab that bounty on the bounty target let's make this quick 25 are left keep your eyes peeled Oh, tragic, tragic. You... Uh, that is so rude. Aha! Yeah, be mad, baby. Be mad. Loadout drop headed your way. All right. Uh, specialist bonus. UAV. Need recall. Dropping into the area. UAV beginning flyover. This is gonna be a little bit unfair. Hmm. UAV is out of fuel. Returning for resupply. Got him. Calling for area recon. UAV beginning flyover. 
We definitely get this guy at the end of the hall. That guy, I think, just dropped in, like, literally on top of me. We're on top of the other side, actually. Nope, 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 nope. That's chalked. Gas is inbound. All right. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the sky. I say I was getting like no Amos is there for a quick second. People seem to be a little more spaced out at the moment. We're gonna go grab this guy's down below here. Oh, hell no, dog. He's got prox mines too. That's wild. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of people over at Living. I'm gonna have to go make a... I'm gonna go make an appearance. What you doing down there, big fella? Nope. You know, we'll go grab his little scavenger package there real quick. And there's actually a big game down here. Totally okay. We kind of got a, like a built-in uh, fire sale just because of hard line. Precision, that's kind of rude. Mm. See, I'm not going to mess with them, but if he's going to be in here. Not about to let you do that. Oh, hey. We can definitely go on the roof and get this guy. No, come on, dog. Oh man, he's about to run up on me. Ooh. You're in the top ten, nice job. There's somebody else I think that was firing from Okay, so down there, probably back behind me somewhere. I don't know. Doors closing, that's got to be second level. Those doors, at least. Bounty target has been marked. End them. Where are we at, pal? Ah! 
the top five. Smash it. You know, I saw that one guy over here. If my bounty's actually gonna be here, like, I'm just about to go for the bounty instead. Nearby comms tower activated. The enemy is tracking your location. Oh my god. <laughs> Well, no, and nope. See you later, baby. See you later. Yep, yep, yep. It's your boy. All right, so of course, the setup here we are running is going to be the XM4 is our primary, the Marco 5 is our secondary, double time overkill amped, that lethal throwing knife, the stim shot is our tactical, and let's hop in here and build this XM4. So this is the Annihilation variant with diamond camo on it. Pretty cool combination, but uh, anyways, first thing, Muzz, we're gonna go throw on the agency suppressor here. This is definitely the way to go on this gun. You always gotta run the agency. Barrel section, we go throw on the 13.5 Task Force. Definitely my go-to on this gun. You pretty much can't switch this out for anything else. It's not really like a negotiable attachment. Um, in the underbarrel section, gotta throw on the field agent grip, horizontal, and vertical recoil control. All real good stuff. Magazine, we're gonna go for the Stenag 60 round mag. I'm a 60 round mag kind of guy, so I always go for that beautiful 60, especially on my ARs. It just kind of makes sense to have extra ammo in the magazine. And then to finish this off, of course, the optic session, gotta throw in the axle arms three times. So the tried and true axle arms three is pretty much what we run on all of our Cold War ARs. This is my full build here for the XM4. Now let's hop into my Marco 5. All right, now for the Marco 5 builds here, this is gonna be a pretty uh, high movement based one as you guys can probably tell by the gameplay, uh, but let's hop into it. First thing, muzzle, we're gonna go throw on the beautiful recoil booster here for that overall increase in fire rate. A pretty standard thing to run on all these uh, Vanguard SMGs. A barrel section, we're gonna go throw on the Perfetto Lesto 355 millimeter barrel. This is gonna be a straight movement style barrel. You're gonna lose a little bit of that recoil control, but that's entirely okay. I do believe this is still an incredible, incredible barrel to run. Um, underbarrel section, we're gonna go throw on the Mark VI Skeletal, the Mark VI, whatever you wanna call it. I had someone talk to me about that in my comment section. However you wanna pronounce it, this is gonna be the underbarrel we're going to be running. Uh, magazine section, we go throw on the 8mm Nambu 64 round drum. Just gotta throw on the 64. This is just such an incredible amount of ammo to have in an SMG, and it helps you take out two, three, and four people at a time, and that is awesome. Um, ammunition, we're gonna go throw on lengthened here, or you guys could switch that out for subsonic. It's kind of up to you guys. Lengthened is just gonna increase that bullet velocity, but subsonic is gonna keep you um, off the mini map even when you have an unsilenced gun. Of course, you're still gonna be unsilenced, so people are gonna hear you, but they won't get that red dot on the mini map. So it's just kind of up to you guys. I like lengthened though more often than not, just because I don't mind if people know where I'm at, because I'm gonna go find them anyways. Um, rear grip section here, we're gonna go throw on the tape grip here just to really max out our movement. And then in the optic section, slate reflector here, pretty standard. Uh, you guys could always throw on like maybe like the NIDAR Model 47, but I just don't really think that's going to be the way to go. I just think the slate reflector is so easy to be able to use and see through that you should just run that. Um, stock, we're going to go for the Emirato FR here. This would be great stock here. I pretty much don't switch this out for anything else. And then in perk one, we're going to go throw on Frenzy here for health regen after kills. This is kind of like having in a uh, built-in quick fix to your gun. It's actually really, really useful, especially when you're taking out multiple squads at a time. This is pretty sick. And then in uh, perk two, we're gonna go throw on quick for the overall increase in sprint speed. This is my full build here for the Marco 5. Hope y'all enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, give it a like, subscribe, notifications turned on. I'll see you all later. Just remember, don't triple cap, don't be Randy. Hit him out. Peace.